Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of x Day Let's Play! I'm the Nessologist. You guys know where we're at. This is Demon Souls. We are back in Stone Fang Tunnel. And I'm gonna talk to this... thing. I'm having a seizure right now, apparently. And I just want to buy some more shards of sharp stone because I can afford many that I'm going to use to beef up my S-stock because I think I'm going to invest some time into beefing that up because I think it might do me some good. Now let's get back through this treacherous little area. Not die hopefully. Whoa! That was close. That was actually a little too close for my liking. Alright. Making sure I am actually recording. That's good news. Right. <laughs> I was like, all of a sudden, I just had like a miniature panic attack that maybe I had forgotten to hit record. Even though I know that wasn't possible because I even did a whole little countdown for myself and everything. What got you guys' undie pants in a bunch? Whoa, dude! Pickaxe McGee over there, just wrecking people. Jeez Louise, man. Calm down. Well, that, I'm sorry, guys, if I just made you dizzy. That was... Alright, come on, little doggie. Come on, little doggie. Yup. Why are the frame rates such garbage today? PlayStation 3 is failing me. Alright, there they are, instant spawn of the dogs. Alright, get out of my body! You have such a lurchy walk! I don't like it. Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? Buddy, you didn't like seeing your pal. All right, this is where I feel like I'm getting like ganged up on, man. It's like Fight Club up in here. Whoosh, skadoosh. All right, cool. Cleared out those menacing beasts. All right, now let's deal with this big jerk. Hey. I really don't think it's that funny. Good. Dead. Give me your full moon grass. Thank you. Love full moon grass. Alright, took care of you. Let's go take care of these dudes. I feel like we are just... In the zone with taking down these bros. Alright. Good. I like how he totally glitched out, right? He's like staring me down, like about to collapse, and all of a sudden it just completely goes bonkers. Right, let's get up here and deal with this magic flamethrower dude. You know, we first met this guy back when we faced that Tower Knight. And you, it made it seem like there was like one of these dudes, like he's some kind of like in charge leader dude. Oh! Why am I struggling against this guy right now? Alright, let's go get his full moon grass and let's use this crescent grass right now. Because dang, those fireballs do some dams. Alright. Let's do the catwalk across this thing. Only one full moon grass at a time? Dude, you're getting stingy on me, dude. You're getting stinge. Oh my gracious. I'm telling you guys, though, and I, I said this before, I'm repeating myself a lot, but this has been a nice break 
from that incredibly treacherous Valley of Defilement. This area has been much more friendly to me. And just far less nasty. There's just something unpleasant about that other place. I don't know if it's just all the grossness. Or if it's the enemies there. Or just the, just the environment itself, I think. It's just depressing. Like, this just doesn't seem as depressing. The sound of that water, though. It's raining outside here today where I'm, where I'm at. And, which is making me awfully sleepy, by the way, so if I yawn on camera, I'm, or on the mic, I should say, I'm very sorry. Alright, clear out this stuff for me, please. Thank you. Over here. Hey. I'm here. Hey! Do something, bro! Better. Thank you. Could you clear these ones here too? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Alright. Now we can... Now we can have some fun times. Oh, dead gummit. Alright. Top off the healthage. Let's switch this to full moon grass, because I have an inkling that we're going to be getting into a boss. So I'm going to change away from a fire weapon. Because I have a feeling if it's going to be a boss, it very well needs to be some kind of a fire creature. Okay, still not a boss, but man oh man do I keep thinking one's coming. Stone of Emperoral Eyes. Those are always good to find. Those are expensive. Okay, we're up on this thing. Okay, this is that area I was wondering how I was going to get to. And here it is. Oh, not a spider. Not a spider. Oh, guys. Let me just tell you right now, this is actually going to be anxiety-inducing for me. Because I... I hate spiders. I hate spiders in real life. I hate spiders in video games. This is not going to be fun for me. I do not like spider webs. That is obvious foreshadowing. Obvious foreshadowing of what's going on. I am not feeling so good about this now. I will go back to the Valley of Defilement now. Did I say I liked this area better? It was a nice break. Because it's officially not anymore. Oh my god, I hate spiders. I hate spiders. What is in here? Oh, God. Before I go anywhere too far, I want to see what's around this region. Oh. What is up here? Okay, a goodie! I'm always up for collecting goodies. What oh, overburdened me? Well, we're gonna drop something. Cause I, out of pure curiosity, at least need to know what it is. What do I have that's super heavy? These are heavy. I need to use my. I have so many shards of hardstone. I need to up my shields. All right. Do, is there any weapons I'm absolutely not gonna use? I have like 15 iron knuckles. So let's drop that. Yes. Drop another one, yes. Two silver catalysts, which I want to keep. I don't need a slave shield right now. Get rid of that. I have this coat of plate that I'm not using right now. I should have stored it away. That is not the item that I was trying to get. I'm like, I did all that to get another slave shield? No! No, dude. Let's drop the slave shield again. Drop it. Good boy. Chris Blade. Huh. 
Let's see what that's about. Chris Blade. Ooh. Physical attack. It does a lot of magic attack. So magic might be good because my magic ability is pretty high because of what I am. So, hmm. Maybe I shouldn't have invested. Maybe I'm glad I used quality on that because maybe the Chris Blade... It's actually a straight sword. You know what? Let's equip this in place of the dagger. I want to see what does it look like. It's actually a pretty lengthy sword. And it's pretty fast. Hmm. This might be worth hanging on to. I think I'm going to for sure. And at least experiment with it. Um, okay, enough enough time killing. I think we're gonna have to go down here. Wait, ooh, what's this one do? Or does that just bring it back up? What does this one do? Up oh, here's a mobile. Okay. Well, Guys, it's been nice knowing you. We're gonna go down into this very ominous pit of destruction. I'm like waiting for a spider to drop down on me and like just impromptu boss fight. Oh, yes. That is a boss gate door, friends. That is a boss gate. We're gonna go see what's back here first. I'm gonna explore every nook and cranny, mostly just to. Spider stone. <laughs> it would be spider stone, too. Thanks. Oh, God. It's even worse that I don't have footsteps right now. I have zero footsteps. Alright, piercing weapon. We've got magical abilities. <sighs> I can see his eyes. Oh, guys. Let's just do it. Let's just jump into it and do it. Whoa. Holy mackerel. Okay. We're gonna need to switch to shields. Shields are up! My goodness. Right, this dude's no joke, man. Oh, this dude's no joke. Okay, let's get smart. Oh, and I'm dead. Okay. Wow, this dude's no joke. Okay. So, it seems to me the trick is getting into his grill. Um, I was able to get one magic attack in on him, but shielding is clearly going to be the way to go for him. Oh, well. Alright, well. We gotta get back, to, we gotta go all the way back through that just to get to him. That's the tricky stuff. That is where it gets tricky. It's like, then you gotta go all the way back through. Is this really necessary? Is it really necessary to just clobber me? Oh my gosh, we gotta get all the way back to him. We're gonna try this again, guys. So there's got to be a real way to deal with this guy. Do you mess with me if I... Yep, you sure do. 
Yep, you guys all want a piece. You are a mean bunch. So let me... Alright. This actually does pretty good, because they're weak against magic, too. And ouch. This has magic capabilities. This actually might be a little nicer right now. Oh, man, I want my souls back. You know what? Before we go back through this, I kind of want to beef up this sword some. I'm wondering if this is going to... You know, I found it right before that spider. I'm wondering if it's going to help me in the fight against him. Because a lot of the enemies in this, they're, they're weak to piercing weapons, they're weak to magic. This sword has a lot of magic infused in it. At its base level, it's it almost does as much damage as what my spear does against these guys. So I'm wondering if this, this sword itself is going to actually help me. So I'm going to see if I can. You were just creeping on this spot, lady. Dang, on. I'm going to need to use some consumables. That was all I had? Man. That really stinks. Alright, let's see if we can upgrade the Chris Blade. I don't even see it up here as something that's able to be upgraded. Yeah, it's not. Interesting. So, maybe it requires some other way to upgrade it, or maybe it just is what it is kind of deal. Huh. Well, that's fine. Since I am here, I'm going to upgrade this, because I have a buttload... A buttload of hard stones. So we might as well beef up the shield. All right, cool. So that gives me a plus five shield now. Do come back up. Shut up, bra. All right, let's try this. Let's try this one more time now. So we upped, we couldn't up the, the, the Chris Blade, that's fine, it's pretty sweet, so we're gonna, we're gonna experiment with that, between that and the spear, I think I'm good on weapons, the shield, now my shield is much more powerful, that may come in handy against this soon. I am starting to get to a point where I feel like I get to these bosses and then just get stuck, I don't understand. Alright guys, we are back. <laughs> All right, guys, we are back. Sorry about that random cut. Uh, we're going to get right back into it. Apparently, my phone was on total silence, and my wife came home because she thought something had happened to me. Oh, I never saw this here. What does this do? Oh, interesting. Ooh, that was a near-death experience. I never noticed this here before. Oh. Anyway, yeah, she apparently my phone was on total silence. She was trying to call me and then thought something was wrong with me, so she came home just to check on me, make sure I was good. So that's what that was about, so... I wanted to uh, say hi to her for just a little bit, but we're back into it. What is... Interesting. Oh, that's worth coming down here for. And overshot it. There we go, cool. Now we'll go back up. This is an interesting little side quest here. Yeah, I'm wor wondering about this sword, and now I'm wondering about this shield. I just made it a plus five shield. What's up on this platform?
Ooh. New little area. Oh no! No, no, no! That was dumb! He was not taking a lot of damage. Oh, that stinks. All my souls were, that were at the boss. Luckily, though, I did spend most of my souls, actually. I spent the vast majority of my souls on beefing up my stuff. So, alright, let's... I'm gonna... You know what? I'm taking that dude down, first off. Taking that dude down. We are not getting hit by them rocks right now. That is not what I'm feeling. Alright. Let's try this again. I'm ready for this dude this time around. I will touch my blood stain. Hey, dude. Bye. Good ratings. Good. Were those the dudes throwing rocks down at me? Crushing battle axe. C crushing battle axe. Not just battle axe. That doesn't sound awesome enough. Crushing battle axe. A renowned soldier soul. Okay, so good. So we found some little items. Items are always good to find. That was really dumb. And unnecessary. Wow, what is going on with your face, Schnoz? Wow, look at the backgrounds here. I'm just actually taking this in for a change. That's interesting. What's over there? I think I'll eventually find my way over there. Oh, this is a long haul. Oh, let's go, let's go! Even Schnoz looks a little bored right now. Look at that face. That's a face of boredom. There's our platform. Yes! Alright. Let's be on our way, friends. We've got a spider to kill. This... That's not cool, dude. Not cool. Not cool. I want to equip some half moon grass here if I've got some. I do have some. Cool. Because, you know, it's grass time. Come on, bruh. Thank you, little doogies. Alright, first off, I'm not getting ganged up on today. So, we're taking you guys out in some type of a manner. Whoa! Whoa! That was a fireball from the deck. You pick up this spider stone. Wow, you guys are dropping this now. I guess that's just a thing now. All right. So I think you need death. Oh my gosh, really, sir? Oh, jeez. What do you just you got the timing of a champ here, bruh?
All right, you dead? You you good? You good, bro? Excellent. <coughs> Pardon me. I like to cough when I do playthroughs. Alright, there we go. Ooh, examine the corpse. That's a sharp stone. I like sharp stones. Sharp stones are good. Sharp stones are grand. Do, 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 Here we go. Alright. Let's cook this dude. Cause I'm just gonna take his grasses. Your grasses are mine, sir! Come on, throw your fire. Yeah, yeah. Throw a fireball. Good. Dead. Let's go get his grass. Whoosh. Whoosh. And run across this thing. Alright, let's get to the spider. I want to try to see if I can do anything against this spider one more time for the end of this ep. This ep has been action-packed for multiple reasons. Oh, that's funny. totally gonna edit it out but it was really funny because my wife comes in the door I heard, heard my door my front door is kind of behind me and I totally like heard keys like somebody like opening the door and it totally scared the crap out of me <laughs> so I just like jumped up and like trying to figure out what the heck was going on it was it was pretty good it's totally not gonna be in this video but it was really funny All right, through the crazy waterfall that cuts in and out. We're up here now. I'm gonna fight this oh, this dude again. This dude's getting on my last nervous system. Come on, dude. All right, good. Okay. That was a near-death experience. Let's top off our health with that. Let's get our magic ready this time. And let's, uh, let's go get this guy. Hey! Throw a fireball! Oh! Good. Is there any items in here I missed? This seems like an area that would withhold items for me. I guess not. Alright, another full moon grass. Okay. Let's run through this area. Let's get our sword back out. Oh, I just realized... The Chris Blade. What else does this do? It gave me a little green arrow icon. I want to see exactly what do you do. Oh, here we go. A small ceremonial sword. Old runes are expertly chiseled into the blade. Used as an aid for incantations. The wielder's magic ability increases, though he or she will suffer more magical damage. So it basically does the same thing as that magical sharpness ring, where it ups my magic power, but lowers my magic defense, which honestly is fine. But, uh, this guy's going to be using fire, so we'll see how this holds up. Come on down here, bruh. That actually really might be beast my magic. I can't speak. Beast my magic up some. A lot to see. Alright, you know what I think I'm going to do this time? Just because we've gotten to face this guy once. Lift this back up. 
I'm guessing now all of a sudden this is going to be usable. Yes, of course it is. Bring up this thing. I am going to use an infopermalize. Let's see if I can actually say this correctly. It is a stone of ephemeral, ephemeralize. Well, let's use one. Let's get our... Let's revive ourselves. I have footsteps again, which is always nice. It's always a nice perk of being alive. And I'm going to unequip... No. I'm going to unequip the cling ring and put on the ring of magical sharpness. Let me actually go to my equipment. You get rid of cling ring, magical sharpness, up. Oh, coat of plate might be handy. Although this gives me more magic defense, which is already at a low for me. Oh, fire defense, though. Goes up with coat of plate. So let's put on our coat of plate. Fire defense goes up here. And fire defense goes up here. So let's do that. I've still got all my rolling ability. I think what I'm going to do... I'm going to keep that blade on for now. I'm going to substitute my spear for my other silver catalyst. I've still got all my rolling. That way I can shield and cast magic. Because that's going to be key. Yeah, let's do it. I think we're in for a treat, guys. I really hope. I really hope. I really, really hope. Oh, man. I need a break here. I need to beat a boss. It has been rough. I've been exploring this, kind of feeling this game out long enough. Oh, gracious me. Here we go, guys. Let's do this. Let's just keep shielding against these things. Good, good, good. All right. Feeling good so far. I'm out of magic. Alright, let's finish this guy. We got him! Oh, we came in prepared and we finished him off. Demon destroyed. Oh, that feels good. And we got the achievement. Oh, guys. See, the key was keep your distance on that one. That is one you want to keep your distance. Use your magic. Clearly beefing up my magic ability really did good. So I didn't even have that sword equipped at the time. But that ring really, I think, really beefed up how much damage I was doing. We've got plenty of spider stone. Whatever the heck that's going to do. Oh, yeah. Feeling good. Pure Spider Stone and a Hard Demon's Soul. 
So let's head back to the Nexus. Let's see what some of these other demon souls do that I have. If they get me some spells or whatnot. And uh, yeah, let's let's see what let's see what happens, and then we'll end this episode on a win. I'm super pumped. Finally beat another boss. I was really starting to feel lousy. Oh, I felt good. He was super intimidating too. Was he? What's he sitting next to? Did he take his helmet off? Has it been there? There's just a bag of goods. But perhaps our age. No, we already exhausted your dialogue. Okay, I mean, that's probably been there. I just didn't notice it before. I thought he was sitting next to something. All right, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah. Let's go back here and let's see what this guy can do for me. You have your wits about you. Surely you understand. I do. Me. I'm pretty sure I do. I don't know. I don't know, dude. Fire spray. So I get the hard demon soul. Shoots a small fireball. Can be fired continually and while moving. Dude. That sounds like something that could be used later. Okay, and the iron demon souls. That one I've known about. That one incre increases my damage taken. Decreases my damage taken, sorry. That I definitely want. That I definitely want, and I... Let's do away with Flame Toss for now and do f Fire Spray. I want to see what this... Bring me more Demon Souls when you... I don't know how much damage this is going to do, but... That's pretty freaking cool, and it doesn't use that much magic. Interesting, okay. I'm curious to see what that'll do in combat. It might be pretty weak. It may come in serious handy though. So, especially against this beast that I'm gonna have to go up against here soon enough. Let's put our spear back on as our second weapon right now. I do have the s stock. I'm really curious if I can get the s stock beefed up some to start using it some more. All right, cool, 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 cool. Well, we're gonna try that out for a little bit because honestly, my other one is about the same power. Yeah, we'll try it out. My other spell, I have this, The my soul ray actually does pretty good damage and it pierces. And then this can be my fire one for now. We'll see how it does as a combo. Um, guys, thanks for coming and watching this episode of x Let's Play. I'm the Nassologist. I appreciate all of you. Please, if you like this video, hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And certainly you'll want to hit that bell as well because you'll want to know when the next episode is coming available to you. I look forward to seeing you guys. Thanks again. Bye-bye.